enter your life, everything around you won't collapse. Your blood pressure is going up, Abby. Eh? And somehow, somehow, somebody came and they are telling you that uh, give him time. Now, people will not like him, are trying to destroy his name. Are you and destroy once or on destroying the Tifnubu's name? Tinubu enemy. She, who? Shakpa mercy bien. Go ya ko, in case the Shakpa bag bo Frenchy. Shakpa John now, yen lo yini yoba, koti ele bo. Shakpa please now. I don't know the German of it. I don't know the Chinese uh, or Mandarin of it. If I do, I will tell you. Sure you get. Remember this guy I played for you earlier? Hmm? The one that is praying for his uh, his wealth, uh, his uh, fuel tank, not to move. Cruz and the rest of you, you know what I mean? Eh? It made it to the news. I want you to develop the Kuba you. I see where I saw that one earlier. Give me one second though. I'm trying to find uh, it's this uh, clip where Rufai and the guys, but it's okay. I'm going to go listen to this prayer first. I'll take a few calls, like I said, if time will still allow me. Or we should just catch our crews to the rest of the program and I'll, and I'll go to bed. It will take us some other time. But I will show you. They are now trekking everywhere. It made it to the news. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Heavenly Father, in Jesus' name I pray. Father, this fuel I bought for 7,000 Naira in UD King Filling Station. Father, my God, I pray that this fuel gauge will not move from this place until Sunday in the mighty name of Jesus. As I move from place to place, from Manzayan to Tamunu to Ekobasi, to Mbukpa, I move to Watts Market, I move to University of Calabar. As I move to Motala Mohammed Highway, State Housing, Akai Fasa Resort, Parliamentary Extension. Father, I will move with this fuel. From Asa Resort, I will move to 8 miles, Blitz Continental, Eko de Nebong, Ekorinam. Father, my God, Spring Road, I will move to Mbukpa. Everywhere I go to, this fuel gate shall never move in Jesus' name. Father, you said in your word in the book of Matthew chapter 7, you say, ask and it shall be given. Seek and you shall find. Father, I have asked. Your son, Engineer Mike, have asked. Father, let it be given unto him in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, my God, you have assured us in the book of in the book of Isaiah chapter 43, you say, fear not, for I have called you. I have called you by name, you are mine. When you pass through the fire, you shall not be consumed. And when you pass through the waters, you shall, they shall not overflow you. Father, as I pass through this fire of 510 naira per liter, Father, let it not overflow me. As I pass through this fire of 510 naira per liter, Father, my God, I pray, O oh Lord, I shall not be consumed in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, I remember vividly when your son Jesus Christ was passing through turbulence. He said, peace be still. Father, I said, peace be still. Fuel gauge be still in the mighty name of Jesus. This 7,000 naira fuel, I will use it, Lord, in the, in the mighty name of Jesus for one full week in Jesus' name. Father, I pray, O Lord, I proclaim your word. If I be a man of God, of which I am not, Father, I declare by the power that raised Jesus Christ from the dead, that this fuel gauge, by faith, it shall remain here for one week in the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you for answering. We may be hungry, but we can manage our hunger. We may be hungry, but we can manage we may be hungry. Shut up, all you. We may be hungry, but we can manage our hunger. You may be hungry, but they believe that you can manage your hunger. Anyway, I'll show you that one. Where it, it made it to the news. Especially from Lagos. Now that Lagos, local, Yoruba, local. Now that center where... Yoruba has rejected Kolu. See what they subject them to in Lagos. I have seen some of you have been like, now nah, so they are not be the same Lagos people. Not be the same Lagos people. No, don't do that all. Let's be honest So Let's be fair Because a lot of you said, eh? you know the thing for some of you to, to carry down your brush and begin to paint everybody with the same color. Eh? All these Nigerians, they, they go just die. My you go leave them, let them die. What happened to those who stood up against them? They did stand up against them, didn't they? Millions rejected them. Oh. We saw that too. Oh. Lagosians rejected Tifnumbu. So don't start laughing at them and say, uh, look at them, Lagosians. They are now trekking. See, they are now trekking. Instead of them to fight, don't do that. Don't do that. 
we look what you know when you are not being by me. Oh, she will not by me. I will not allow her with the time. We get some mad people with the year too. We they will try to cure. No different from that. It's like place we say with the cure, with the cure different, different, uh, you know, mental damages that Nigeria has done to a lot of people. So sometimes when you see some of our members who are sounding like, uh, they don't sound like us, they sound like people we say, you know, something like Spanner don't lost for their brains. Eh? And you're like, ah, I thought you are a Mayagun supporter. Why are you talking like this? As you won't want to So you get some of them, eh, we are still working on them. It's a work in progress. So that is why when you see some of them here, you say, ah, but you are my ego, so why are you talking like say, we return won't be ni. Alright, but that thing yako yano ni. You can't make you if he didn't do, he didn't do ni. So when you see some of them, they will just pick up brush, and they begin to paint everybody. Don't do that. Let's be let's be fair. Let's let's kind of be fair. Eh? So Lagosians rejected the APC. Egbe egbe. Now, them the con they use for news now. See, see, Lagosians trekking. Some said now punishment for rejecting Kolu. Now, it's so it's so bad, eh? That's one thing I don't like about us, all right? Or sometimes we like, kind of love to blame the victims. Sure you get. And he said, hey, they deserve it, Jerry. Everybody go die, Jerry. I'm tired. I said, if you are tired, does that mean all of us have to go and die? I mean, if I am not tired, and you are tired. The same that all of us we should be tired. Well, am I going to waste my time, Jari? Everybody go 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 down, Jari. Everybody just go. I say, me, I don't want to go that way. Oh, sure you get. So we have them here. Once they pick up the brush, Jorubas, you see, my egun, my egun. You see, there's something I want to. You are doing a great job. You see, my egun, man. Jorubas, Jorubas are very very corny. Yorubas, are, you cannot trust Yorubas. Not you, oh, my egun. Not, not your own Yoruba, because I know say you, you are very. They are, Oh, Nikuri, man, why me? Why why Jimmy on some me be Yoruba this Yoruba that? Then you want to take me out? So they might know you, my own, my own, you, you, you. This not your own Yoruba. Or somebody come and they start saying that. Uh, hey, you see all these uh, Igbo people? They are so proud. They always feel Lego. They say we rating she we rating. Eh, come on, ni. But uh, Osita, you know that Osita. I I like. I prefer Osita Igbo. Like that kind of Osita now. Now that kind of Igbo I like. Now uh Olori Ibu. Your jamu brush, you done painter. When the healing gets to your side, you will drop the brush, you will understand the whole thing, and then you stop using that technique to escape your own uh, echo chamber where you only hear yourself. Pangolo koro 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 to one. You know, see that you know on Nishek Baluejo. On my diary political, all of us agreed that uh, eh, foolish people also grow old. So don't they look at me and say, "Ah, agbala agbala umba we be ye." Yeah, yeah, yeah. Talo sobe kwa agbala agbala ye. Toru buti, toru because you have a jabi. Foolish people also they grow old. Stupid people also they grow old. If people, if foolish people know they grow old, why are they using the word "fool" at forty? Say "fool forever." Show me forty years, you are kidding me. Person will be forty years now, small picking. Eh? If to say when person don't turn no, do what the bank call you are now agbala agbala. You now you now get sense. You know get sense from from the day they born you. You know, get sense with your life experience. Sense you see no gets, even when you uh, when you seems to be growing old. You now turn forty. You want to call it form a guard to go, a guard to go, Tani. Eh, mole be a more. It doesn't matter. Sure, you get. There are people that are, you know, a lot of people can born almost thirteen years ago. Only be more. So no, there's no bragging about it, baby, because you are balaga. Mole be a lot more. Oh, le be me lot more. Come on, my jacob be more gone. Cause you know you can be more. Are you with me? So we have them here. People who love to hide behind their own bigotry, behind their own whatever. The people who have refused to unlearn what they have, what they have been told. So we have them here. And I don't think it's good for us. It's not good. When you can easily just jump at it and say, hey, can you go? no, 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 don't do that. Or do that, Jare, because sometimes they say, when you close your mouth, eh? You know what I mean? When you when you close your mouth like this, a lot of people can see, think, ah, oh man, look at that guy, handsome, oh, yeah, handsome. See how that guy handsome, and you know, he looks so intelligent. See how he's dressed smart, and all of that. And people they look at you and say, sir, hi, 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 sir, hi, hi, all right, sir. Then you come open your mouth, they can say, where they want to sort of man. Say, I know, 
Now your crush talk you, Auntie Yola. I did the Yola. Kilo D. No, sorry, sorry. Mu borrow constant. Mu that we the consort on see. We the one who sort on see here. The Yola crush yellow sorrow. I'm touching crush if I'm saying. See. Ah. No shanu me okay. But boy, you bati my line no yeh. You bati my swear anything. So that I go to look at her and say, ah, wow, I met, I saw one guy today. He's so cute. He's, he must be intelligent. I want to see him again. Don't, they say, keep your mouth shut. Eh? And you can keep everybody guessing to think that you have intelligence or you kind of have something up there. When you open your mouth, you remove all doubt. Eh? Anyway. I will leave it at that. So, uh, for those who walk on the street, I want to show you that again. A quick one, though, before we take one or two calls, and I'll go to bed. They are not feeling the heat. For what I know, lawmakers got free 70 billion. They are not feeling the heat. They should speak for themselves. So, why is Mr. Bayanonuga begging Nigerians now? No, no, he should not beg Nigerians. Please, he should leave Nigerians alone. They plunge Nigerians into this. The APC plunge Nigerians into this because of their terrible planning. I asked Professor Killer a very technical question this morning. I said, do you see rigor in the thinking of government? He said, no, no rigor. You know what that means? That's an indictment on government. You remove subsidy. Are you worried? Oh, good. 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 I was young now, so they will just capitalize on your. Uh, did you see that guy that wore white t shirt and the black uh, pants? Yeah? Oh, dear, yes, yes, yo. It's not by choice, though. Since uh, the money you will pay for transportation, eh, the money you will pay for transportation, a loan from your salary, will just make you be like somebody where they go one place, they mark register, go back home. Last in army. She you get. So some people are not going anywhere anymore. Warfare. Eh? Others who felt like, you know what? I'm just going to be using my car for Uber. For day one. Eh? Now neighbor can't con set to the fight inside their house. Because by the time he went and he came back, number one, fuel for tank, don't finish, right? Money, you know, day. Because at the end of the day, the money he actually believe he made will not buy him another, he won't buy him another half tank that is going to take him out tomorrow. Now they would need to eat back to square zero. That's what people are actually going through. So nobody will teach you. Nobody will tell you. Eh? My ego is just going to keep reminding you. For now, it'd be like, say, there's nothing you can do. And others said that, uh, okay, what will happen after the tribunal and the court? I said, they will figure it out. Okay? And you should never forget my word. My word is that a lot of you are not those who are going to break up Nigeria. You see, the revolution that will take over Nigeria is not going to be planned by anybody. It's not going to be anything that you're going to say, oh, let's, you know what I mean? It's going to start. And the only shock that will happen is that uh, the level at which people are going to respond to it. You see, this entire, oh, I mean, this whole thing, eh? it has to calm down. Before you can begin to even figure out what do you want to do next. You see, this entire establishment, oh, my collapse, oh, my crash, right? And it's not just because me and you want it alone, no. You see these guys, they will push you to do it. The day you are going to be shouting, freedom, freedom, freedom. I don't believe that they do amo. They don't push us to the wall. I will be here eh? to remind you. So I'll leave it at that. And then, uh, should we still take calls? Are you sure? It's already like... I've, I've actually spent 150 minutes or nearly. Eh? So, I hear your voice. I'll take calls. So, if you call me in right now, I'm going to pick it. Okay? And sure. Let's see. 
Did I just miss one there? I'm gonna. Okay. So uh let's see this. Someone. So uh let's see this. Yes, I I, I said it. Hello there. So uh let's Hello, good afternoon, sir. Hey, good afternoon. I just lost one and I got another one anyway. How are you doing? Okay, my name is Okay. I'm very well. I just want to tell you I like your show and it's very encouraging for young people like me who don't know something about Nigeria. Good job. Thank you. Uh, sorry, I just kind of had a break there. Oh dear. She didn't even kind of tell me her name. Anyway, uh, darling, I would love to know your name, ma'am. Okay, you didn't give me one, so I have another caller. I would love to. Hello, yeah, there. hello, sir. My good evening, sir. Hey, brother, how are you? I'm fine. I'm fine. <laughs> it is. Thank you always for. Wow. Thank you always for enlightening us. I'm fine. I'm fine. Great. Yes. Because uh, the reason why I even called this night is particularly about that um um the increase in the school fees. Um, I believe you, you, you all know that um, um, uh, especially this Unilag, Unilag, they've increased their um, uh, our school fees by 400%. Uh, percent. Um, a DLI student, I'm speaking from perspective now, from real perspective now, a DLI student is expected to pay nothing less than 130 or 140,000 per, per year. And from what? Or as it used to be like? Are, are you with me? Okay. With no, that's the, no. Um, previously it was one twenty, one ten. So gradually it 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 is now increasing to like one thirty, one forty. But the most shocking part of it was that um um two or three weeks to, uh, before the exam, they just brought out one policy that every student, every student should pay fifteen thousand naira. Now, sir. Just ask me, what's the fifteen thousand meant for? After you've paid for every, you've paid for everything. That fifteen thousand is only meant for electricity bill, utility bill, and which they've collected for it before. Now, at least in DLI, we have we have almost like um five thousand to, if I'm not exaggerating, almost eight thousand students. Now calculate five thousand, um, fifteen thousand naira, and then if not because of the student agitation. They don't want all, they don't want the student to write the exam just because of fifteen thousand after you've paid for almost like one forty thousand. This is the real real perspective I'm saying. Mm -hmm. Now they've included that now after much agitation from the students, you know, they've now said, oh, this fifteen thousand it has now been inculcated into your bill that next year you're going to pay it. But the real shocking now that we've been hearing rumors that the school fees will now increase to nothing less than three to four hundred thousand by next year. And currently, a lot of people defer just because of this uh, hardship. Now, is it, is it not coming back to everyone now? Uh, both the Ababa who, both the, everybody, whether not touching everybody. PDP, whether none of them whether is where PDP, everybody will collect. Whether, is it not touching? Well, time will tell, Sha. <laughs> Thank you very much, Idris, sir. Nina is one, right? <clears throat> I have another caller. So, thank you. If you are still watching, yeah, I managed to get the 400 people to go back and uh, like that uh, video on YouTube. We still have over 3,000 of us there, which means a lot of you didn't even listen to me. You didn't care. Thank you. Hello there. Hey, my evening. Hello, sir. Good evening, yeah. Good evening to you. This is, yeah, this is Austin from the um, state of Maine in the US. State of, what do you mean by a state of Midwest? The state of Maine, 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 Maine. M A I N E. Do you know, I actually heard that, but something just felt like Midwest. <laughs> I heard Maine. I was like, no. Maine. That's yeah. Small. Yeah, that's some small space there in the US. That's class. How are you doing, Austin? Yeah. I'm doing all right. How are you? I'm very well. Thanks for asking. Yeah. Yeah, man. I, first of all, I want to thank you for your program, um, for all this enlightening everybody. And all what you do, and um, I try to like your program every day as soon as you start. Thank you. I, I, I watch sometimes I'm on my phone, sometimes I'm on my iPad, on my laptop, That's or my TV. Kind. Thank you. <laughs> so That's I make sure, and I, and I try to share it. So, um, but I, um, 
the 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 thing I just want my point is um I have a few points but I'll just go to like two. Uh, yeah. Um one the for scarcity in Nigeria and the whole issue, I mean, I don't <laughs> it's um it's kind of funny because I think Nigerians really don't know what they want. See when when um before the election I have been I've been watching your show since uh, I think um, uh, you know the Kalu I mean kind of I was uh, yeah it's been a while introduce you yeah yeah but I've never called I just always watch your show I enjoy everything you do and um, like I said Nigerians don't really know what they want um, because you want us enough. You know, they want us enough. Everybody keep wanting us. I, there are people out there, but you see, our people are always about what they want to eat. They don't care about right their future. Right now. Mm -hmm. Correct. Correct. They don't care about their future. And I'm glad that um, what Tinubu is doing to them right now, the Shege is showing to them. Yes, sir. I am so happy. You'll be so surprised about people even here in abroad, that they are supporting this APC, knowing fully well you, that APC has nothing, like zero, to offer Nigeria. You know, it's unlike... And they like, are like, I'm so surprised always, right now. Ah, uh, the Tinubu... Yeah. Yes, the Tinubu <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't expect this from him. But you know what they <laughs> used to console themselves? Maybe they should wait. Maybe they should wait. Maybe everything will still come back. Maybe it's still... Right. <laughs> He hasn't released all the latest. Uh, he hasn't released all the another set of thieves. So the court minister. So you know what those Brother, ones do, one, eh? To one, peel fat, to steal, and all that. Yeah. go see him. One day, hmm. one day, fool, fool, Ninuya. <laughs> he suffer. No be from here. He go come from Jerusalem and and and, and uh, Jerusalem and uh, what is and Saudi Arabia come Nigeria. She be not the one key there. That's what finance go come from those two places. Come the come this come the. You have issue with See, poverty, like, unemployment. People are playing religious <laughs> tribal card. You are joining <laughs> them. Are you I'm not telling mad? you, you, bro. You'll be surprised that people here in abroad. Eh, I'm telling you, like people will not get people out. Eh, who did they support this to Nubu? <laughs> Within the supporting black like, people, must be saying, you, Baba, because, I don't like you. Like, nah, I was like, nah, they, <laughs> you are facing the toughest kind of economic hardship when a religion, <laughs> tribe, really matter to you. <laughs> that they are like, I want to see energy during the election. <laughs> Madness, I'm telling you. I'm telling you. In fact, Baba, this is just tired me, man. That ah. is a you be <laughs> now. Uh -huh. See, like Princess, Princess actually said, right. Now we will with their abroad. Now we go, now we go sit on library that country. Hmm. I'm telling you. Now we will with their abroad because once this place is no longer suffer, comfortable for us. I'm telling you, brother. I'm telling you because the suffer with these politicians don't make our people. Our people no get like you like you said. Our people no get one energy to fight. No energy even to fight. Hmm. even our our traditional rulers. They don't turn them to puppet. I was watching the show the other day when they said they will call this one. This one will come, they will come to it. I was dying laughing because I know somebody will laugh to myself. <laughs> I, I had to call my friend and say, are you listening to my ego? He said, yeah. I said, they're here with my ego. They said, but <laughs> like, bro, brother, it's true. Like, and I was, look at, look at what Benga Dani was saying about um, the about uh, what this guy in Jebulan. And that no, handed the contract no, to, to, I will yeah. never forget it. I will never forget and it. I say it everywhere brother, I go. I will keep saying it. It's a shocker. Brother, brother that is a, the corruption. It's not even the people in the government. Now, everybody for Nigeria. What thing they want chop? No make them get sense. Hmm. Period. Period. Uh, my evening, keep, yeah, keep up the good work, Thank man. So keep up the good work. I every day I appreciate you, Thank and you. I always make sure I share your program. Bless you. and I like it. So you. just keep up the good work. And yeah. one day I know, I know we'll get, we'll get, we'll get there one day. I we'll mean, one day, one day they will push us there. Even if, we, <laughs> even if we know we'll go there, eh? they will still have to take us there eventually, Definitely. consciously, Definitely. Or consciously. We are getting close. Thanks a lot, Baba. Definitely. I appreciate you. Thanks. Now, mentioning Princess uh, in that call reminds me of, uh, I was going to give you an update on yesterday. You know, I said, when I showed you the clip of a Yoruba Union uh, activity that we went to do, right? I didn't show you everything. We did a lot. 
we actually reached a lot of people, right? But I think uh, showing uh, Mr. Lukman yesterday kind of made him our priority. You know, his, his condition is is debilitating. It's terrifying as well. Like, it's sad, completely shattering. So I felt it. And that's why I shared that with you yesterday, among others. There are other stories too, people, our people. But to my own very much amazement, eh? I told you, I said, we haven't started raising any money for him. But if anybody feels like uh, they could reach out or give anything to him, I can document that, okay? And they can actually start something for him. I wasn't expecting anybody to, because, you know, usually everywhere hard right now, everywhere tough right now. And me, self, eh, knowing that uh, money no easy, eh, I don't feel comfortable coming here to say, yeah, please, so my people, go and bring out your wallet like we normally do. Yeah, bring out your wallet, too. bring out your this and that, too. Sure you get, because I know see everywhere dry, everywhere, sorry, everywhere tight, or maybe not for my own people, okay? Because I know if I ask, I'll get, I just have to ask for a good cause. So I went to bed and I woke up this morning. So two people responded with a very, very good uh, offer. So Mr. Lukman needs a serious medical attention. And I woke up this morning with what you can convert to the ruined and destroyed Nigeria Naira, 700,000, 709,000 Naira that they deliberately sent to me. I don't know if they would like me to, to, I mean, to say their names, but you know yourselves, only two people. One person gave 515,000, and that's half a million. That's, you know what, Mayegun, for medical care, and any other care that you are providing or we, the union want to provide for Mr. Lukman, urgent care. So I've discussed with the uh, with Princess and we are going to have uh, the leadership or what you call the leadership meeting of Yoruba Union this Sunday, okay? Now at that meeting, I have already made a proposal that by Monday morning, eh, we are going to take Mr. Lukman to the General Hospital in Elori. I have been told that they have a real specialist on almost everything there. They have all the kind of all the machines and all that technology to kind of run tests and all that for him. So we are going to take him to that man you saw in the video last night. So uh, we're going to take him to the hospital tomorrow. I mean, sorry, on, on Monday. And we're going to deposit half a million there. 500,000 that will be deposited in his name. And we're going to drop him there for them to run the full check on him, everything. And they should make recommendation and tell us what does, I mean, what, does he need? What does it, what's it going to take eh, to try and put him back in some level of uh, a little bit of comfort that an elf? And make I tell you another thing, just because from last night, one of the leaders of the Yoruba Union has already volunteered to adopt. Mr. Lugman has four children. His wife left him. So he's just by himself. The children always go about to beg money, to beg for money in order for them to feed those children. And the story has gotten uh, the attention of one of our leaders in Yoruba Union, who has decided that uh, it's already, she's offering now to adopt two of the children. Eh? And adopting them means this person has a school. She has a school in Lagos, like private school. She lives here in the UK. Now she is going to adopt two of the children. And they are going to be uh, enrolled in a private school, from primary school to university level. She wants to take over all of that. So the children will be going back to their father if he accepts that offer. The children will be going back to their father at, on every holiday. That's the time they will, they will be spending with him. Then, I mean, immediately when the school is in session, they will be in school in a boarding house funded by Yoruba Union. So the other two children, we are also tabling, we are looking into other things we're going to do. People are going to adopt them. And on and on like that. So I thought I should give you that update. Or maybe I'm saying them to you earlier. Eh? Don't worry, I'll tell you more about it later. When I meet the leaders of the Yoruba Union. We have people who decide now, not just me. They are watching me, look at them. They are always there. The people who decide what to do, when to do them. How much money do we have? What do we have in savings? What do we have in, you know, that stuff. Me, my Yegundi convener. All I have to do is just to listen to all the ideas. And if I'm on the side of any good one that we all decide to go for, that becomes our next project. You can join us. Yeah, you can. Yoruba Union on Telegram. Search for it. You see us there. Okay. What we do is voluntary. Okay. We don't, 
You know what I mean? Like, we don't have any any kind of, uh, you know, hold on you, okay? If you join us, you can be a volunteer on anything, okay? You can be part of, you know, there are those who volunteer to teach people Yoruba in Yoruba Union. For those who have family and children who don't speak Yoruba very well, and you want them to, right? Materials and all that to help them. In Yoruba Union, we have those who are volunteered. Mrs. Musari, that's the head of our education team. She's doing a wonderful job. You can do something too. You can share it, uh, I mean, uh, tips. So for some of our videos, our, I mean, our, our supportive, uh, you know, uh, gears, clothes, shoes, money, and all that. We have people who go out to see those we believe really, really, really need them. You can join us. Eh? So anyway, I'll tell you more about that later. Okay? So yeah, we have about 700,000. I will raise millions for that guy. I hope you kind of have that, have that in mind, yeah? Through this platform, with your support, we will raise millions for him. Any, any amount of money that will put him in a kind of comfortable space and shape that we can say, well, fair enough, he's better off now. We will do that for him. And when that starts from Monday, eh, with the Yoruba Union. So if you want to support him, you need to reach out to the Yoruba Union. We don't want a situation whereby... Uh, because it's our project, by the way, all right? So we've already been, like, uh, already giving him uh, all the support that we can, including the one we are going to. We don't want a situation whereby uh, they will say, ah, Mr. Lukma, we can go, can you call ya? Help us, help us support him more. And you start sending money to him, start sending money to him, start sending money to him. And suddenly, Mr. Lukma's bank account is with millions. Eh? And the people who have abandoned him and all of that for a while, they will come. And the story will change. Later, they will say, ah, Mr. Lukman, that they helped on Mayegun's diary political. He don't they beg again. Now, this is not Mayegun's diary political. Sure you get. This is a Yoruba Union, an organization, registered organization that takes it upon itself to advocate eh, for the independence of Yoruba nation. But by enlightening and supporting our people who have become the victims of bad governance, in that same Yoruba land, when they are kind of well informed, no matter how long it's going to take, we are willing to go that. That's why we said it is a thankless job. If you are looking for any recognition, may they give you title, two, may they give you this one that you are not, you are going to be joining a wrong team. Oh, don't join us. If you are looking for this title, two name, all this thing that will make you important, don't join us. We are just volunteers. Eh? Most of what we do are thankless. We don't look for anybody to say, ah, uh, me, I mean, our last year, look, see what we have done. No, 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 no. You're going to be in the wrong team. It's all about what can you give? I give, everyone give. We pull all our resources together and we go after those we believe are vulnerable enough to receive our support and our message. I've stolen part of your time. Sure, you get, I was supposed to continue to take calls. Then somebody just mentioned that. And I was like, no, I won't go tonight without telling you that some very good people, eh? And I've also received messages from those who have messaged me, asking me for Nigeria bank accounts of the union, okay? Yes, they do. Princess, if you are here. So if Princess uh, is watching, right, uh, you can also share the official bank account, the Nigerian bank account of the Yoruba union. There are people who have sent me messages asking for them. Make it public. It's always public anyway. So to those who actually did that for us today, I say thank you and God bless you. You don't know what you have done or you do know what you have done because we do appreciate you. Uh, here, hello there. Okay, I lost him. So I'm going to take another one. Hello there. Hello, my brother. How are you? Good evening. Very well, sir. How are you? Okay, I'm going to sir. Jide from London. Hey, Jide from London. Okay. Man. Oh, okay. Yeah. I want to, I want to, yeah, I'm very well, brother. Okay. Um, I want to I want to pick up your brain on something and you see where I'm going. Okay. You know, That's my it. you you were born in Ijebu, have you? Well, I was born in Ijebu, raised in Ijebu. Can you believe okay. that? Ah, oh, oh perfect, perfect. <laughs> now because you're now, before because you're born in um, Lagos and uh, you are an Ijebu man, it makes you an authentic um, Nigerian first, and then going down, you are an Ijebu man by century, okay? And uh, three, you are Lagosian, Abi? 
Well, I am. I'm actually a very, very Lagosian than Tifnubu and the rest. Okay, fine. fine, fine, fine. So I'm, I'm submitting, I'm submitting my case. I'm making a case. You are the judge now. You are the... uh -huh. Okay. Now, if you're born in the United Kingdom, should be you be you be uh, regarded as a Britico, a Abi? British or Nigerian British or British okay. Nigerian, and then like that. they have all the way they call, they call then, them together. Go on. Yeah, they call them together. And then the the Wayo uh, British people, if you're now playing for if you're now playing for England, they will call you an Englishman, which yes. is not possible. It's not possible. For a black person to be yeah. Englishman, I always thought it's not possible. It's, 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 it's an injil or something, you know. It's it's a sense. Now that brings me to the next point. You see that guy when you played those, I saw those things. I tear tears started dropping my eyes, and it at the girl, and I said, "This is the situation, not just in global land, but across Nigeria. And yet our politicians are so heartless. The the um the the senators are overpaid and all that all what is happening and people are so heartless people are suffering and it's because this is are the ones that you brought to the fore that we know about there are so many people that have suffered even we've, we've had our our, our nollywood um, actors have suffered and then died because of some um uh, so because of five million to things that uh, exactly. could easily be avoided though. Um, exactly. I, I don't know. People have started kind of sending in money. Well, thank you. I, I can't say no I, to money, oh, but there's going to be a time yeah, when once yeah. we know what is going to really take us yeah. to take care of our, our you know, rehabilitate uh, Mr. Luke Mono. Yeah. Somebody just yeah, sent me yeah. uh, over 100 pounds in cash up. Thank you. No, Mr. Taiwo. No, no. What Go on, please. Mm. Uh, GD, please. Sorry about okay. that. So, so, so what I'm going to say, uh, this thing that we saw yesterday mm. is beyond the mm. union. Mm. Yoruba Union, Biafra, and everybody, we are all brothers. Yes. I, or regressively, there's this, there's this person, I don't want to use a, a cost word, because I it nearly dropped from my mouth, and I asked him, are you, are you not a human being? He was saying that uh, we should, uh, sh we should check his uh, political um, leaning. Oh, I saw before... that, I just deliberately ignored that. There are people like that. that is, I just ignored that. that. that is that is not nice at all. I don't know whether the gentleman is uh, watching. That is not nice. You need to ask your question. Your humanity. Where is your humanity? So, um, based on that, yeah, I was born in Lagos, but I've, I've spent a major part of my life um, in this um, in um, in the UK and all that, you know. And that makes me, although I'm not Yoruba, but I speak Yoruba more than my where my dad is from in in um, in the east. Yeah. That makes me a Yoruba person, so I can benefit it, even say, you Yeah, I'm part of the uh, bust your brain, Jude. My brother bust your brain a little, yeah. right? The, yeah, you just like the, 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 number, yeah, yeah, now, the number of people who are actually messaging me who said mm -hmm. it, from last night till now, I've received about uh, four mm -hmm. messages. Now, out of these four messages, mm -hmm. three of them are actually mm -hmm. people mm -hmm. who didn't want to say they are Igbos, they just said, I'm not Yoruba. I love what you are doing. Can you send me a link on how to support as well? I'm not Yoruba. And I'm like, that's one thing on this mm -hmm. platform, right? Humanity, you said it, right? Humanity. We don't care where you come from. Okay? Exactly. Once we decide that this is uh, something that, oh, no, no, no. Once the humanity kicks in, right? Every other thing will fall. Mm -hmm. Nothing else matters. And am I aware what you're doing is humanity because you could spend all these evenings that you've been spending here or uh, instead of talking about Nigerian problem and all that you could spend the evenings the lovely evening doing what uh, spending time with your family or or having food but you keep on ranting your head, your head will be, I, and I kind of appreciate sometimes how you get upset. I get upset as, as well. I, I just, I would, my, my, my fiance just called me and I said, listen, I'm on my, let's talk tomorrow, please. I need to speak to my, so please, if you could yes, tell me, yeah, yeah, so please, if you can kindly send me the link to, you see my number, if you can send it to me, what it to me, um, I'll be here. And then if you can ask the Yoruba Union, and at least that they sh the, the membership shouldn't be just people that are Yoruba and sensory. I mean, why people the are link born is always people. open. Jide, Jide, uh, see, we already uh, have yeah. non Yorubas yeah. within us as well. They are mostly observers, exactly. and I see them all the time, exactly. just they're observing, not unruly or exactly. in any way. And I love it. Exactly. So what we have there is exactly. an open forum, right? What we usually do on that open telegram forum, is yeah. this, okay? Uh, we we have an idea. It's thrown open. Mm -hmm. People started talking about like, okay, what about that? What about that one? Those who are like uh, mm -hmm. the appointed uh, representatives, they pick on them. 
Then when we meet and have a chat, yeah. which we always have all over the world, okay, we come together and discuss all these things. Now, once people say, mm -hmm. why don't you let us do that one? Then we begin to do the cost, mm -hmm. cost effective of that. Like how much is it going to be? What's that one going to be? Mm -hmm. The moment we move on and mm -hmm. say, okay, yeah, we're going to do it. That's how we do our things. Mm -hmm. Because mm -hmm. it's okay, I'm sure you get. Not that anybody is mm -hmm. giving us anything from anywhere, just us. Yeah, so yeah. And lastly, mm -hmm. yeah, and lastly, I know, I know you're not very, uh, you're not a very religious person, but I find it bizarre and unnatural that somebody stepped out um the early wee hours of the morning to pee, and then he stepped on something. Not that it was an animal that beat him, and he was infected from the wound, and he's, you know, I oh, think God. that man. Yeah, Adam. Apart from our money, we need to also support him with what money cannot buy, and that is our best wishes and prayers. And that's where I want to, I want to come in. So if you can just send me all the details and all that, I would. And hey, and if you come, I don't know whether you have another video, you know, because I've got some other groups that I belong to. I can actually show them and say, listen, hey guys. This this is this this is this this is this. Is there any way we can reach out to these? Uh, I have uh, videos, but you know something, right? Yeah. Uh, they mm -hmm. are so they are so kind of touching and important, right? That uh, I know we end up having to run a, a full show on it one night. Okay, to show all of okay, that's fine. What, who we have met. There is a lady. Let me tell you one story too. Like you ask now, okay? Mm -hmm. There is this mm -hmm. woman. She's also mm -hmm. very much uh, uh, disabled. All right. Mm -hmm. and uh, she is a very good weaver she weaves wow. uh cardigans jumpers okay right? now, wow the way she has been sustaining herself was that uh, somebody mm -hmm. would go and look for if you want to do a jumper for example right so i yeah, would say yeah. oh, i have somebody who can do it for you sure you get mm -hmm. and they will say okay how much is it going to be for example i can say mm -hmm. oh it's going to be 600 naira Right mm -hmm. now, from that six hundred naira, she she herself, who is going to and weave all of that, she will only make two hundred yeah. naira from it. Even if wow. they say one thousand naira, she only make two hundred naira from it, and she can take days to make one. Sometimes, right now, that's how she's been surviving. So she's now made few, wow. right? She's made few that she was displaying, and I said, with five hundred thousand naira, eh, mm -hmm. invested in her mm -hmm. business. I can turn now, mm -hmm. and all of us here can give us, we can turn now into an international businesswoman that is making a hand with and with what have you. So disability mm -hmm. can become ability in that regard with little support. So I, I yeah, will need to run a program of so many of them. You, you get yeah, what I mean? there are some organizations, there's an organization so that I know here. There's even like, there's organizations that I know here, I know that they can even reach out to come to Nigeria if they be, and, and all that. And they yeah, through us. And we are registered, yeah. by the way. We yeah. are not just somebody who names us. We didn't just name ourselves. Oh. If you go onto the CSC yeah. in Nigeria right now, eh, uh, mm -hmm. we, mm -hmm. you know, just search for Yoruba, I mean, sorry, uh, Karo, Ojiri. Oh, That's the registered name, yeah, Yoruba be. Union. Yeah, it's going to pop up okay. on their website. Everybody should go and try it. Sure you get, eh? Yeah, okay. So it simply okay. means that uh, everybody that is working with us and everything that we are doing, we have to keep record and documents. Okay, okay just so you get. Okay, just to, okay. Sorry to interrupt. Just to reiterate again. Um, if you can leave the link again on the description link on the um, on YouTube, uh, where to click to join. Yeah, I'll I'll, I'll, I'll be very good. I'll, I'll drop that. I'll do just yeah, that. Yeah. Don't worry. Then you can right, follow okay. us up uh, through that. Okay. Thanks so much, uh, Jude. Okay. God bless you, sir. You're good evening. Too kind. Thanks, man. Yeah. So I have another caller. Thank you so much, uh, Fumi uh, Olemo. I don't know if I pronounce that very well. Or you said that is uh, for uh, Mr. Lukman, of course. Okay. So, however, it is better to use uh, the cash app or use the uh, PayPal. So, I have received another tenor on PayPal from somebody. So, for now, I can't give you all the all I have. But uh, like I said, once we take him uh, to the once we take him to the hospital. And they are able to run the check and tell us what is really wrong. Okay. Somebody said that, uh, you know, we should also go spiritual. I was like, mm, pray for him. Okay. But when it comes to medical, I want, uh, you know, we would like to have answers. Yeah? Answers to what is going on. Not that just pump money at it. You know. And if you have to, like, take him out of Nigeria, we can afford that. Or are we going too far? We can afford that. Sure. Hello there. 
Hello, Mayego. Hello, sir. How are you? The CEO. Yes, sir. Of yes. I salute you personally. I salute you. Bless I really appreciate. Really appreciate. And uh, I'll be following you for two years plus, and uh, I'll be making efforts for me to get in touch with you. I know that, but I'm always on the queue. This is my first time where the line I went through. You are, finally, you are here with me. I got my yes. visit back anyway. That's why I'm uh, 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 right. first timers. I, I actually appreciate it. Thank okay, you, and uh, I'm calling from Dublin. All right, from Dublin. Your name? Yeah, the nice one, man. Nice one, bro. Nice one. Uh, for, first of all, I just want to congratulate you and thank you for everything that you've been doing. You, okay, you are eye opener. All right. If we've seen three people or two people like you, I won't lie to you, right? Where we came from could not be perfect, hundred percent. Okay, so I must thank you very much, and uh, I don't really want to go into details, but I just call you to thank you for every single thing that you've been doing. Thanks, okay, thanks. for you, uh, for your humanitarian, for your generosity, exposing politicians, the 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 Carlo and all that and all that. You know what I mean? Yeah. Listen, I appreciate that, man. I appreciate that, bro. Thanks, okay, thanks. I appreciate that. One love, man. One love, bro. Yeah. One love. You have a good one, eh? Thanks a lot from I Dublin. Like That's a class. I love Dublin people. Do you have a name for Dublin people? Like, you know, Londoners are Londoners and then uh, Glaswegians. The Glasgow, the Glasgow people are called the Glaswegians, right? Uh, I don't know what they call the Dublin. I know. I don't know. Right. Um, do I have another caller? Hello, can you hear me? Oh, Biafra. Oh, hello, Duduwa. Oh, El Biafra. Oh, El Odudu. Brother, how you doing? Yeah, I'm good. One day, hello today. <laughs> it's yeah. a long night, so yeah. imagine, oh, we are almost yes. three hours, and people think that, yeah, you know, stay on. My ego. My ego. It's weekend. I don't know how you do <laughs> it. I don't know how you do it, man. Much respect to you. Thanks, you know, the energy, you know, the, the energy you're giving out is just, is marvelous. Um, what it's very do, therapeutic bro? healing, it's the you know. Least, we it's need the you. Can do. Oh, it's the Listen, we appreciate you. Oh, thanks, man. You know, we really appreciate you, man. You're, you're really changing lives. You know, a lot of us are depressed. <laughs> a lot of us are, are, so get, are suffering from de a deep too. depression. <laughs> yeah. You know, this thing, every day you hear the news, is just like, it's what nice. else? What else? Yeah, how is this thing happening? You know, but it's happening, you know, right in front of you, it's happening. You know, so, um, just and then you always wish so it, so sometimes you wish it's a bad dream that's going to go away, but you realize that you're not sleeping. You need to be sleeping to be dreaming. No, you're not dreaming. You are alive. It's real. You better stop living in denial. Yeah. That's another sickness, though. Living in denial. And we'll yeah. be like, no, it's not. Yes. Happening. But um, it's kind of good, you know, everything that we warned of, especially those that were supporting Tinubu and everything, it's like, usually it will take a little longer for it to hit. It's almost like it's happening instantly. You know, they're having an instant regret. And um, I mean, time after time, like, what else do we have to do in order to open their minds and let them know, like, it's not working. What you're doing, you're going on the wrong path. You know, like, when are you going to stand up for yourself and look for something better? You hear praising these people that's looting money day in, day out, and you you are you look at yourself every day. Ten years from now, you you're still in that same position, suffering and smiling. You know. Somebody said that. But you uh, go above. It's frustrating if you take a look at if you realize that you are growing, but your life is stagnant, mm -hmm. is depressing. Yeah. And I know that uh, is a Nigerian. You know when things eat you, sometimes yeah. you become a philosopher. And you begin to say things, and I, was, yeah. I, I read it, and it was like deeper to say it's true now. Eh? When you turn 40 and you look around you, there's not been any, any single progress around you or in your life. Eh? Isn't that frustration? I mean, sorry, frustrating enough or depressive enough? And you it have it really is, Michael. Who are like that right now. Yeah, you know, I have cousins back home, you know, that, um, you know, when they call me, it's the same thing. You know, I feel sad. And even I tried myself. I went above and beyond. I lost so much money, to be honest with you, Mayagu. Mm. If I would have saved that money that I lost trying to help them back home, I think I would have been in a better position to actually help them now. Wow. 
you know, and we're not talking about, we're talking about over a hundred thousand dollars, hmm. you know? So it's, it's, it's frustrating for us in the diasporas because their hurting is affecting us also. It's affecting everybody. You know, there's no escaping it. And then some you're trying to make, you know, trying to tell them, listen, we need to do something about this. It's like they're fighting you. Mm-hmm. You know, so it's like, my like, keep doing what you're doing. Keep pushing forward. You know, you got my support 100 percent. I'm going to yes. donate towards this movement. Thank you know, Biafra got you. No. Free Mazin Andicano. Free Sunday Boho. Free all the innocent people, you know, locked up unjustly in that damn right. damnable zoo called Nigeria. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Biafra. Oh, yeah. Biafra. Thank you so much, brother. Right? Uh, yeah. Let's say uh, I'm thinking of uh, calling it tonight. I know a lot of us still probably want to call it. But I am going to uh, plead with us that uh, let's do that some other time. I'm sorry I took all your time. I took I took two hours. I shouldn't have. I should have like. But somebody told me that we should continue with the cruise. My ego continue, continue. Don't change it. But uh, eh? we'll continue later. Okay. Thank you so much, all of you, with your generosity, for your support, and for always believing in your geo, the general overseer of the temple of truth. We all have one currency that we trade here, and it is called trust. So I have earned people's trust, and I am the banker of that uh, trust, so which simply means that uh, if you see some certain things around there that look so kind of unreal, they are real. So as we are talking right now, the man we met yesterday, I can tell you now that uh, with what I have seen so far that are coming in, eh, or more, so it's probably already, uh, you know, we're already having uh, close to 1 million Naira, okay, uh, as a Yoruba union. And Princess, I told you to share that uh, Nigerian uh, bank account number, the Karo Jiri account number, that goes straight into the Nigerian account as well, right? So, well, I'll check all of that back, and I'll give you feedback on that, okay? And also, maybe when we have the leadership meeting and the rest, there'll be more, all time for me to share the full the full trip with you eh? including when we met other school children student, you know it's wonderful but oh, i'm gonna go tonight okay thank you to every one of you uh and then they remember if you have already liked the broadcast don't like it again that means you are taking it back okay but if you haven't at all don't live without uh, doing it it's kind of you know it's what shows that you are here i will see you some other time Good night. I 